Now let's send it to Ricky Sayer, who continues our coverage. Here in Lost Creek, like so many places in eastern Kentucky, people woke up to the devastating scene of water in their homes, around their homes, and no way to get out. More than 20 people were rescued out of this small town here. Many of these homes are low lying and the water just rose up very quickly. And here at around two in the afternoon, the water is still rising. It's actually the reason that the Lexington Fire Department is about to give us actually a ride across the water you see here. We had driven across here in an ATV. The water was very, very low and it's come up a lot since then. And the fire department uh, has been gracious enough to get us across here. It's the reality for so many here in Eastern Kentucky. When Lexington fire crews who are on scene briefed us around two, they said they were still looking for 12 people who may have been stranded by the rising water. Later, we learned a total of 26 people have been rescued. They have gone on 18 individual missions. They have also said everyday people have used their own boats to rescue neighbors. They rescued 10 to 12 people. The Lexington Fire Department had their own crew in the water going from home to home. We spoke with multiple people who said they lost their homes. I just came out and explained what I'm going through because I've lost everything. It's like sparks. I've lost everything I have. I've lost my car. I've lost my car. I couldn't get my car out because. It was already too deep. My car is a low rider. The Lexington Fire Department was originally caught here because there is a Christian school across the river where we're told 14 people were trapped. Fire officials told us that everyone was able to get out of that school. A staff member there told us that God was with them. In Lost Creek, Ricky Sayer, LEX 18 News.